Thiago Silva, the vice-captain of Chelsea, is not satisfied with the chaos currently surrounding the club and calls for a clear direction for the future. Subscribe, leave a like, and turn on the notification bell on this video, as it is very important so that you don't miss the latest Chelsea news which we post here. Thank you. Continuing. This is a difficult time for the club, characterized by great uncertainty. Change of ownership and new players. We had to expand the locker room because it wasn't big enough to accommodate all the team's players. On the positive side, we have great players within the squad, but on the other hand, there will always be players who are dissatisfied. Some don't make it into the squad, we bought eight players in January. We need to stop and establish some strategy, otherwise we may make the same mistake next season, Silva said in an interview with TNT Brazil after the 0-2 loss to Real Madrid in the Champions League quarterfinals. As he highlights, Chelsea bought an incredible amount of players last year after American top Burley acquired the club. In addition to a large number of signings, Burley fired Thomas Tuchel and Graham Potter as manager. Frank Lampard was appointed interim coach for the rest of the season, but Chelsea lost all four games under his command. I believe the first step has already been taken, which was a wrong step, but it was taken. We cannot blame football coaches and avoid taking responsibility ourselves. There is a lot of talk about changing the manager. I believe that we, the players, must also assume responsibilities. We have already had three coaches this season, besides Bruno, where we could not win games. We lost against Real, and we couldn't win with Lampard. The manager can only select 11 players from a group of more than 30 players. It's difficult. There will always be someone unhappy because not everyone can play. Everyone is talking about the coach, but we have to look at what went wrong and try to change that, Silva added. In my opinion, Thiago Silva was spot on in his speech and told the truth. What is your opinion? Leave your opinion in the comments. I say goodbye to everyone here with a big hug and until the next video.